So the Hamlet test is a novel behavioral apparatus that uh, has been designed for laboratory mice. The idea is to analyze topographic memory and spatial memory in a complex environment. So the apparatus has a central place, a central agora, with streets expanding from it in a, sh a star shape, and it leads to houses that have been functionalized. In the first one, animals can drink. In the second one, they can eat, play in tunnels, uh, interact with a stranger mouse, or run in activity wheels. And the video track system can take information from each houses and from the general exploration of the maze. So animals can be habituated to this uh, apparatus during long period of time and uh, they will learn the topography of the maze by latent learning. So in my laboratory, which is specialized in neurodegenerative disease and particularly Alzheimer's disease, we wanted to design a test to analyze one alert sign of the pathology, which is a spatial temporal disorientation. So in this test, the protocol we use is we habituate animals four hours per day during two weeks. And after two weeks, we can measure topographical memory by checking the ability of the animals to go individually to the drink house. So we take out the bottle one day after and we measure the exploration of the animals in the maze. And in fact, we could demonstrate that animals habituated to the maze have a shorter latency to go to the drink house. And when Alzheimer's disease starts to uh, begin, they lose this ability. So when we analyze the behavior of the animals in the maze, we analyze their brain and we realize it induced a very strong plasticity in the brain. So it's not only a topographic memory test, but it's also a complex and rich environment. And this opens a lot of potential applications, not only in neurodegenerative disease, but also in uh, developmental uh, pathology, in uh, neuropsychiatric pathologies or uh, in ethological studies. In particular, it can be completely adapted uh, because each house can be uh, modified, so it's a particularly versatile apparatus.